Here's how to clear your iPhone cache. Now let's first just head into the settings and I'll walk you through a number of different options you have. Let's scroll to the very bottom and tap on apps here. From here, we'll scroll down until we get to Safari on this list. There it is, tap on Safari, and we can delete the cache for Safari by just scrolling down and hitting clear history and website data. Now you can choose all history, all profiles and tabs and hit clear history. Just like that, you've deleted out all the cache and cookies for your web browser. However, keep in mind, apps also have cache that are storing that basically data on your phone. We can go back and hit general and iPhone storage. From here, we can essentially remove all of that cache just by offloading it. So you'll notice Instagram is 930 megabytes. I can just offload this app and reinstall it. And I'll show you after I reinstall it that it's quite a bit smaller. So it went from 930 megabytes all the way down here. And you can see where is it? Maybe it's still installing on here. It is still installing on my phone. It's taking a bit of time to install. But essentially, once it reinstalls, it will install keeping your login, keeping all your data, but deleting out all of the cache for that specific app. Now, you can go through and just tap on a bunch of them, hit offload, and then reinstall. You'll be able to see the app size for this is six uh, megabytes, whereas the documents and data, which is essentially the cache, is 790 megabytes. So after we've done that, we can also go into your messages. So open up the messages app here, hit edit at the top left and show recently deleted. You'll be able to see all of your recently deleted messages. Again, you can tap on delete all at the very bottom left and then just hit delete all these messages and that will clear out all of the basically superfluous messages that you don't really need in that app. Now, keep in mind, in apps themselves, there are also options to clear the cache. So, for instance, let's open up Spotify here. And we can tap on the profile at the top left. And then settings and privacy. From here, you'll be able to see storage right here. Tap on storage. And you can just hit clear cache. And just like that, within the specific app, you can go in there and clear the cache. Keep in mind, this is not for every single app. Some of them have this option. Some of them don't for whatever reason. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below. Really helps me out. Thanks, guys.